Hey guys, thanks for joining me again. Uh, this is just a quick update on the Cub Cadet uh, 127. Uh, when I got it home a week or so ago, I put it in the shed in the driveway, which is just one of those tarp type buildings that I use for the tractors. Uh, the problem is, is it sh it's shoved into the corner, so access to it has been pretty limited. Uh, it's also pretty cold outside, so working in there has been kind of tough. I've been trying to take off what I can, put penetrating oil on the bolts to get them ready to come off. I also did an oil change on the engine, so that's done and ready to go when that gets the chance to crank it over. I took off the carburetor and put a plastic bag in the intake hole to prevent anything from getting in there, but I'm going to clean out the carb when I get a chance. Also taking out the old uh, dead battery. I found a rat's nest inside the uh, steering column area. I ended up having to use a leaf blower to get it all out of there. It was packed in there pretty tight. The other issue I'm having is it's dark early, so uh, working on this by flashlight is pretty slow going. I mean, by 3 o'clock in the afternoon, I'm using flashlights to work on this in that tight corner. So it's been slow going as far as getting into it, and when it's 10 degrees outside, you don't, really don't want to go out and work on it. What I have been able to do is get the air cleaner and some other parts off and degreased and paint it up fresh so they look nicer. Uh, I got the air cleaner, the gas tank, the gas tank straps off and uh, cleaned up and painted. When I get a chance I'm going to uh, take the carburetor apart and see what that needs. I figure I might as well do it now in the winter and get everything rolling for when spring arrives. I also been on a uh, quest for parts for this tractor. Looking at the wiring, I can tell it's pretty rough. And rather than chase electrical gremlins, I just ordered a whole new harness for the tractor. Um, I also ordered a new hydraulics uh, filter for it, and I'm gonna be getting some other parts. At least this way, they'll be on the shelf and ready to go when I get a chance to get out there and put it outside and really work on it. I also scoured the gas tank, uh, a little bit of a redneck invention, but it worked well. I put some BBs and gasoline in the uh, tank and strapped it to the wheel of my tractor and let it spin for about an hour. And the gas tank came out nice and clean and fresh inside like it left the factory. So, Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day.